I had it done in Bombay. It kind of all blurs together. I was so little. <laughs> I just remember there were older women. I think they were wearing saris. They were laughing and it was very comforting before what happened to me. And then all of a sudden I was on the floor. I do remember being held down and they lifted my skirt and they did something. I didn't see what it was. I just remember feeling pain. And I remember afterwards my mother comforting me. I was born in the United States. Mostly grew up in California. The type that my community practices is known as type one, which um, technically they just removed the clitoral hood. So it's supposed to be just like a little pinch of skin. Um, so I'm assuming that's what happened in my case, although I've heard my, some of my other friends say they've gone to gynecologists and said like their entire clitoris was gone. I do remember actually having a kind of party afterwards. My mother inviting her friends and, and they came over and so it was celebrated. It's a very old practice. It's crazy to think that it's still continuing now. here and because it is it happens in secret and generally um, it's known among the communities that practice it. My sister had it done in the US. I do remember my sister crying a little bit when I saw her. I didn't see her until after it got done and she came back home. At that point, I was still kind of in the innocent area where I was just like, this is something that happens to all of us, and this is something, like, now it's happened to my sister. It's invasive in the idea that it's coming in and you are removing a part of um, a person's body and it's altering their future without their consent and altering it in a way that this is how you're supposed to act or this is supposed to be, this is supposed to be your girl you're supposed to act this way it's a sense of control being taken away from this young child about her future I remember just wondering like did this play a role in my sexual abilities or do I not like sex as much or would I enjoy it more I was angry at one point, really, really angry, but I feel that I kind of came through it with, it was hard to reconcile this, this notion of like my parents are loving parents and everything and that they were just doing what they thought was right. I wish it didn't happen to me. It's a very complex tradition, complex reasons for why it's occurring, and that it's in order to really get it to end, that it's not, there's no easy solution. If there was, it wouldn't be continuing right now. It would have ended a long time ago. 